Life after last week's vlog has been very relaxing. It's safe to say that I'm finally clean now. I'm finally doing things that I love to do. For example, I like to sit around and watch the highlights of Ronnie and Sam's fights from the Jersey Shore. And I like to do other things like... What the... Fuck! Who is editing this vlog? Guys, we can't be putting that in. I... I... You... I don't want this in the vlog, guys. Guys, I'm honestly so excited to start vlogging for you again. I mean, last week, it was just a time in my life that I just had to deal with. I had to get through it, and I did. So I'm really excited to... Who the hell is here? I opened the door to find that Skusenberg was at my house. If you need a refresher from last week's vlog, Skusenberg is a very powerful drug dealer. We did um, some very good business together, so I don't know why he seemed to be pissed off with me. As Skusenberg proceeded to bash my face in with the metal pole, he explained to me that he was upset with me because he had caught me doing deals with a rival dealer. I mean, I didn't realize Skusenberg saw me, but this was all in my past, so I didn't think it mattered. He beat me until he thought I was dead, but a professional like him doesn't panic. He knew exactly how to get rid of the evidence. it in and with three seconds left Cleveland triggers in James two seconds one second for the win oh! LeBron James delivers <laughs> well, now that I'm finally out of the straw dealing industry and Skusenberg thinks I'm dead it's time for me to try and find a normal job, you know, live low a little bit. I'm not very skilled in anything, so I'm gonna have to whip up a resume to try and see if anyone wants to hire me. I see that you're hiring. You think you could get me a job? I wasn't able to get hired at any real established business, so I decided to take on the competitive world of lemonade selling. Hey man, first customer. Thanks for- No, I'm not a customer. You're not? I'm a neighbor, I live down the block. Yeah, I think I've seen you around. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what this is. I mean, you're like 25 lemonade selling thing. lemonade. Hey man, everyone's gotta make money somehow. You're like... scaring the kids, I have kids. No, I saw a bunch, they they were running, but they looked like... What even is, is this pissed? Sir, I don't get... That's fucking terrible. Clean this shit up, wrap it up. Alright, I'll... Wrap this up right fucking now. Sir. The next job attempt I decided to take on was to be a personal trainer. It went really well at first, but it never really got any traction because Gianna ended up being my only customer. Back up! Back up! You got it! I decided to put the job search on hold to spend some quality time with my girlfriend. What's your favorite part about going shopping with me? You tell me I look cute in everything. <laughs> you look cute in those. You have these. No, I don't. You basically have these. Yeah. When have I Ow. ever worn? Oh, Gianna. Why do shoes have... <laughs> we're gonna do a bet on uh, what number register we're gonna get. Okay. Okay. Whoever's closest to the number, the other person has to pay for your shoes. <gasps> really? Seven. Okay, so you're picking seven? Lucky number. I'm gonna do six then. Okay. <laughs> it's a close call. Yeah. <gasps> they just got six. That definitely means you're not getting six. Oh wait, I'm betting on six. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> Cashier number seven. No way. Are you recording this? No.